Hi everyone, it's Kino here. Welcome to this gentle yoga class. I'm coming to you from a misty morning here in beautiful Vietnam. So let's close the eyes, come to a comfortable seated position and bring your hands together. A long deep breath in. As you exhale, let's rest the hands down, keep the mind open, the heart free, and allow the body to slip into the vibration of healing. Then a long deep breath in, and as you exhale, let's softly open the eyes. Another deep breath in, and now we'll start to release the neck. Let's drop your head over to one side and start to just roll a little forward and back. Very good. And then let's see if we can add a little hand action in so you can reach the opposite hand to the head and drop the shoulder away from the ear. Good. Just lean into it for a moment. Let the neck muscles release. Good, okay, let's come on back up and we'll do the other side. Come on over to the other side and start to rock a little forward and back. And then let's get a little shoulder action, drop the opposite shoulder and let your neck muscles release, keeping a quiet sense of ease in the body. Very good. One more. Okay, let's come on back up. Now we're gonna lift the ribs away from the hips and have your a little gentle spinal twist. So just allow yourself to twist lightly over to the right side, drawing the navel in. You could take your hand and press down on the knee a little bit. Nice, easy does it. Good, let's inhale, we'll come back to the center. Let's try the other side. Inhale, we create length between the ribs and the hips and just lightly find that twisting action. Reaching over with the hands, if that feels good for you. Keeping the navel in and feel yourself growing taller and taller, longer and longer. Good, and let's come on back in to the center. Good job, ooh, there was a large bug. <laughs> okay, let's come onto your hands and knees. <laughs> and good, enjoying the beautiful natural surroundings. <laughs> let's curl the toes under and then let's inhale up to downward facing dog. All right, downward dog. <laughs> Good, let's roll through the hips, right? We can bend the knees for a moment, straighten the legs, bend the knees for a moment, straighten the legs. One more, let's bend the knees, straighten the legs. Let's hold it there for about five breaths. So we have one, deep breath in, deep breath out. Two, enjoying the moment. Three, Four. This is another creature. That was actually a beautiful one. Five. And we're going to take the right hand and reach over to the left ankle. Just give yourself a little twisting action. Good job. Stay for another moment. And then let's switch the sides so we can come on forward and reach and twist. Good. And then let's come on back forward. We'll sink the knees down. And then let's extend the legs forward. All right. Coming forward, taking a moment. Lift in from the center of the body and then exhale, fold. Paschimottanasana, or forward folds. So sink into your hips a little bit and kind of massage the hip joints. Very good. A long deep breath in. And then as you exhale, we'll fold. And we'll stay for five. So we have one, two, keep the mind calm, three, four, five. Inhale, let's lift the center of the chest up. We get a big breath in, exhale there. Let's scoot just a little forward, drop the navel under, and then bring the right foot over for a spinal twist. You're gonna hug 
that left elbow, snuggle the left elbow around the right knee, stabilizing your left leg. Let's inhale, lift the spine, reaching the right fingers back. Make sure not to twist from the pelvis as you look over to the side. And we'll go and say one. <laughs> Good. Keeping the mind calm and steady. Good, we say we've been here for a few breaths already. Let's spiral up through the center line of the body. Very good. Let's say, but now we've been here for five, so let's inhale, we come back to the center, straighten out the right leg, we'll switch the sides, bend the left knee, don't close it all the way, cross it over, hug in, lift the center of the chest up, and then exhale, twist and fold. Good. We have a couple of breaths, scooping the navel in for one. Good, keep twisting, two. Three, almost there. Four, your right leg is stable. The navel is scooping in. Very good. Five, inhale, we come back into the center. Let's take reverse tabletop position. Roll the shoulder joints forward. We're gonna keep the feet hips width apart. Inhale, let's lift the hips up and forward. We'll stay for five breaths. So we have one, two, pull the navel in for three, four, and five. Exhale, sink the hips down, shake out the hands. Now we'll move into Baddha Konasana. So I'd like you to gently bring the heels in towards each other. Open the soles of the feet and we'll hold on to the feet. Lift the center of the chest. Steady deep breaths. One. Feel the breath moving in, the breath moving out. It's important to count your breaths when you practice so you're aware of how many breaths you take. We're feeling the body, accepting all that is. Allow yourself a moment of gratitude. We'll say we've been here for three breaths. Four breaths. Good, let's do one last breath. A long, deep breath in. And a long, deep breath out. Very good. Okay, let's cross the feet. And we'll end in a seated position today. A few moments of mindfulness, bringing your attention to the contact points that your body makes with the ground, feeling the fluidity of breath, body, and mind, accepting all that is, from a space of acceptance, we can see more clearly. We drop the resistance, we drop the fight. From a space of acceptance, we move into understanding and love. Allow yourself to say in the language of your own heart, I accept myself completely. I accept all that is completely and unconditionally. And from that space of acceptance, I am empowered to live a life of consciousness and awakening. A life of love, harmony, and peace. Let's bring the hands together, a long deep breath in. As you exhale, let's softly open the eyes. Thank you so much for joining me on this practice. May you be happy, may you be peaceful, may you be filled with love.